Yo, Joel. So, how old are you? Uh, 11. You're 11 years old. When did you learn to ride a wheel? Actually, it was about a few weeks ago now. Yep. Yeah. And which wheel did you learn to ride on? Um, it was Jacob's... Um... Jacob being your brother. Yeah, He's got an M10 3, hasn't he, as yeah. well, because that's the wheel he learned to ride on. So, same as this, just yeah. like white and these pressure plates were not as big. Yeah, the foot plates weren't as big, were they? He's got the old, slightly older model. So, yours is black for one. It's got the sensor there, as in the switch, to turn off the motor spinning when you pick it up. Okay. So, a lift sensor. So, it's, you've got to wait for it to beep. Yeah. And then pick it up. Yeah. And put it down. Very good. It Useful hit. for when you put it in the boot of the car, etc. And really, you learned to get going on this, didn't you? We tried the 9 Watt 1 E+, Plus, but actually, once you got on this one, you were away, weren't you? Yeah. Slightly wider tyre, we reckon. And are you enjoying it? Uh, yes, I am. You are. And is there anything you struggle with riding at the moment, since you just learnt? Um, backwards. <laughs> riding backwards? You can't ride backwards yet, no. No, not really. I'm... Let's have a look at you go forward, then. Oh, go forward? Yep. Boosh. He's off. Okay, so Joel, how have you been finding the M10 3? Quite fun actually. Yeah, what's it like on the road? Because uh, you learned in the driveway, haven't you, on the grass? Yeah, it is a lot smoother. And like, I can go a lot more faster. Yeah. There's a lot more room. And what's it like for speed? Is it really slow because it's such a small wheel? No, it actually goes 28 miles per hour. Does it? Yeah. What? You don't go that fast, do you? No. No. Not usually. You're pretty dangerous, wouldn't it? Yeah. But. Battery bars, what have you got? Two miles in, basically uh, yeah. full, isn't it? Yeah, basically. It lasts for ages, though. <laughs> it does last for ages, isn't it? Especially some of your size on it as well. Looking good. I like it in the black colour as well. It looks pretty sweet, doesn't it? Yeah. Now I'm going to try a steep hill, aren't you? Yep. Chapel pitch. Go for it. Let's see how this little beast handles it. Lots of torque because it's a 10 inch, 800 watts of power. So how Joel did the uphill go? Um, very 
very good, but I would have to say if I was walking there myself, yeah. one, I'd be very puffed out, <laughs> and two, it would take me like 10 times longer. It would do. It's like a little pocket rocket, isn't it? Yeah. It's pretty cool. And now you're actually going to tie a descent. So we've come up to the end of that hill you just climbed. And you'll see what it is like when you decelerate down Ooh. and how easy it is to come down. Yeah. So how do you find the downhill? Um, sort of tricky. Yeah? Yeah. What was tricky about it? Uh, the fact that you had to go quite slow because yeah. otherwise if you fell down that would very much like, really hurt. It would really hurt you? Yeah. I saw your brake light on the entire time. Shows you how steep it is, isn't it? Yeah. It's still doing about 10 miles an hour but braking. Yeah. <laughs> so that's what a 20% decline does. Incline, decline. But it held you up, no issues whatsoever, was it? No. A lot quicker than walking. Yeah. Let's head off, shall we? Yep. I got a great idea, Joel. Gonna race you on foot. Let's see at this 20 percent here. We got our cameraman. Oh no, camera girl up there. So from where you are right now, we're gonna race. See who's most tired. Oh, the top this telegraph pole. Day, Daddy's crazy. He doesn't. He's not going to win this. Oh. Ha ha. What, you're yeah, I could even do better than that. Oh, right, Joel. You've tired out. Let's have a listen. You're going away from me, though. I can't quite get you. Why well, are you not out of breath? Little pocket rocket. Unbelievable. Okay, so what have we been on? Four or five miler. What's yep. your conclusions then as a first time rider and slightly of the younger generation of the M103? Uh, quite good then, I would say. Quite good. Well, actually, very good. <laughs> very good. Like, the fact that it actually goes Quick. 28 miles per hour as well. But in terms of power delivery and those hills... Very good, actually. You did, yeah? <laughs> Handled it perfectly fine, didn't it? Yep. Any other closing comments on your review? Um, not really. Not really. Just Excellent. Fade to black. You should definitely get one. Oh, definitely get one. Definitely, yeah. Yeah, you should definitely get one. It'll fit in... A rucksack, you know what I'm thinking? Yeah. Because I myself, with the other model, same size, same dimensions, fit it in a rucksack. Yeah. Pretty amazing little tool to have with you. Yeah. Right. We'll see you later then. Bye.